Hello everyone. Today we have selected a very important question which is uh, related to the sketching of cubic graphs and which is involving differentiation also. A lot of students, IGCSE students are facing problem differentiation and sketching of uh, specifically cubic graphs. So today we will be going through this question which is uh, 3 plus 4, 7, 7, 7 plus 2, nine marks uh, question which is uh, very important nine marks you know in IGCSE nine marks can change your uh, grade from A to A star or B to A so you need to be um, focusing on these type of questions let us go to the question question says this is f of x is equal to given as a cubic function a part find the gradient of the graph of uh, y is equal to f of x where x is equal to 1. So gradient of the graph uh, f of x is given you know f dash of x which we can also write as dy by dx. So f dash of x is basically uh, the gradient which is uh, the first order derivative of this one. So we will take the derivative, we will write f dash of x. Now how we will differentiate? If we differentiate x cube, so we are pulling this power first and then power will be reduced by 1. So the differentiation of x cube will be this one which we can write as 3x square. So this will be the derivative and we can write here uh, derivative will be 3x square minus the derivative of 3x square will be what 3 multiplied by 2 so it will be 6x and power we will reduce 1 so it will be 1 so 6x raised by 1 or we can write 6x so this will be minus 6x and the derivative of a constant derivative of minus 4 will be 0 so we will not be writing that one so this is the first order derivative which we have done f dash of x now they are saying at x is equal to 0 x, uh, x is equal to 1 so what we will do we will take f dash of 1 f dash of 1 will be 1 square minus 6 we will replace x by 1 and this will be 3 minus 6 which is equal to minus 3 so f dash of 1 is equal to minus 3 so minus 3 will be the uh, gradient which is uh, this one gradient or slope so this was three marks question which we have done b part find the coordinates of the turning point of the graph of y is equal to uh, f of uh, x so y is equal to f of x turning point we need to find so how we'll find the turning points we can uh, we can take the uh, we know that the turning point on the turning point like this one say this is the turning point so the gradient at the turning point the gradient is equal to zero so dy by dx is equal to zero at the turning point it can be turning point upward or it can be turning point downward so this is uh, a cubic graph so in case of cubic graph we can understand that uh, it will be uh, it will gradient will also be zero at different locations so we can draw a cubic graph like this one so it can be this turning point or this turning point so <coughs> we can take dy by dx and that is already we can take dy by dx or we can take f dash of x and this is 3x square minus 6x and we will replace equal to 0. So 3x common, so inside will be x minus 3 is equal to x minus 2. So x minus 2 is equal to 0. So 3x is equal to 0. This implies x is equal to 0 because 3 is not equal to 0. And the next is x minus 2 is equal to 0. This implies x is equal to 2. So we got x is equal to 2 and x is equal to 0. Now these uh, uh, two values of x we will be replacing in in y and we know y is equal to 1. Y, y is equal to what? Y is here. F of, uh, f of x is equal to 
y is equal to x cube minus 3x square minus 4 and we can replace uh, x is equal to 0 so at x is equal to 0 y will be equal to 0 minus 0 minus 4 so this will be minus 4 so our point will be 0 and minus 4 and at x is equal to 2 f of uh, y of f of 2 or y is equal to 2 cube minus 3 into 2 square minus 4 and this will be 8 minus this will be 4 into 3 will be 12 and minus 4 so this is equal to minus 8 so 2 and minus 8 these will be the two points turning points and this was uh, four marks question which we have done now for the c part c part says sketch the graph of y is equal to f of x and we know f of x is what f of x is equal to x cube minus 3x square minus 4 this is our f of x and the turning points are over here 0 minus 4 0 uh, and 0 and minus 4 this is one turning point and the second turning point is 2 and minus 8 which we have done in the previous part so these two points we will be taking 0 and minus 4 so 0 and minus 4 we can take here so this will be 0 and minus 4 this point and the second point is 2 and minus 8 so 2 and 2 we can take here and this will be like uh, we know standard standard cubic graph is like this one like uh, like this one and if it is uh, x cube is positive if x cube is negative then it will be like this one in in these two quadrants if it is positive uh, then it will be in these two quadrants so we will be in this case it is positive so we will be sketching this we can uh, sketch this uh, which is uh, like for example here we can sketch uh, this is the turning point so curve will be turning like this one and then going to the another turning point I will erase this and redraw it properly like uh, this one and the second turning point will be at 2 and then going up like this one so this will be the turning point and the second, this will be the turning point these two will be the turning points of the graph so this one is 2 so this point turning point will be 2 and minus 8 so we can write 2 and minus 8 like this so this will be the turning point which we have shown over here so this is how we can sketch this uh, graph also this is a two marks part which we have done hopefully you understood this <coughs> these type of questions which are involving differentiation and sketching graph specifically is uh, difficult a little difficult for the IGCC students so and this is the standard graph uh, the properly drawn graph you can see here you can see this is the turning point which we are having 0 and minus 4 and the second turning point is this one which is minus uh, which is uh, 2 and 2 and minus 8 so 2 and minus 8 is the turning point and it's the same shape as we have drawn over here and hopefully you understood this differentiation topic you need to revise properly first started differentiation you should know how we we can uh, drive a function and if you like to have similar videos in future as well so subscribe the channel and press bell icon so that you will be getting notification for incoming videos and recommend this channel to your friends and class fellows. Introduce this channel to your respected teachers. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Bye.